Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you 22 of my favorite nude lipsticks. I felt very inspired to make this video based off the disastrous Jaclyn Hill nude lipstick launch. If you don't know what I'm talking about, just do a quick search on Google, YouTube, or Instagram, and you'll see that she released lipsticks that are of a very questionable quality. So I figured why not compile my lipsticks and show you guys what I like to use whenever I am doing a nude lip. Keep in mind, I have very fair skin and I am 36 years old. So these colors are compatible with my skin tone and I mentioned my age because none of these lipsticks bleed on my lips. So I'm not going to use a lip liner today. I'm just going to put these right on my lips and show you what they look like. Before we get started, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and you hit that notification bell because then you'll be one of the first people to know whenever I release a new video. The first lipstick we're using today is by Becca and this shade is called Mocha. This is a neutral shade out of their lipstick collection. This formula is very soft and creamy. This feels like a very hydrating lipstick. Next, we'll use this Marc Jacobs lipstick in Slow Burn. I really like the texture on this lipstick. It's just very soft. It's a little bit more matte than the Becca one I just used. Now we'll try out this Tarte Salt Life. I love this lipstick. This one is definitely more matte. This is a great color. Now we have Hourglass Cosmetics. This is the shade Futurist. This lipstick is very creamy as well, and it has a bit of a peachy tone to it, so I would consider this to be a peachy nude. Also, love the packaging. It's just so sleek and pretty. Now we have this Fenty lipstick in the shade Thick. This is beautiful. Now we have this YSL lipstick. This is the shade 10. And this is pretty much the same exact shade as my lips. And this is a beautiful lipstick. Very luxurious, very expensive. Now we have this Nude Sticks lipstick. This is the shade Belle. Now we have one of my favorites. This is Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk. Now we have NARS Anita. This shade looks great on lots of different skin tones. I always feel like this one goes a little bit orange on me, but if I have self tanner on, I love the way this nude lipstick looks. Now we have another Marc Jacobs lipstick. This one is called Sonic Truth, and I have bought this lipstick so many times. I love this nude. It has just a touch of pink in it. Okay, we have Bobbi Brown, and this is the shade Pale Mauve. This one is very similar to my lip color as well, and I love how creamy this one feels. It does not last long at all but it's pretty. Another one that I love is Estee Lauder Desirable. I'm almost done with this one. It's just a great shade. This was actually recommended to me by Estee Lauder's global makeup artist a few years ago. I still have it. I love it. We have another Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. This is Kim KW. This is probably the palest lipstick I own. And I got this one at the Makeup by Mario Masterclass here in Dubai when Kim Kardashian was the model a few years ago. Okay, this one is by Tom Ford and this shade is called Pussycat. This is definitely a darker pink nude type shade. Now this lipstick is a nude shade by Bite Beauty. I actually went to their lab over the summertime and I had this nude shade customized for me by a wonderful lady named Joa who works there. And I wanted a light, pinky, nudie type shade. Mm, so pretty. 
and you can actually get the scent put in and the type of texture you want so I went for vanilla this is my customized nude shade okay now we have another NARS lipstick this shade is called Raquel Okay, this one is by the Sephora brand, and it's a rouge satin lipstick, and I think it's shade 61. This is a very pretty shade. It has that lipstick scent to it, if you know what I mean by that. Like, it smells like the type of old-fashioned lipsticks. I don't know. You probably know what I mean. <laughs> okay, we have this one by NARS, and this shade is called Bangkok. I actually never reach for this one, but it's so pretty. I have another Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. This one is called Hepburn Honey. And this one is very peachy looking, almost a bit yellowy on me. Next, I have this shade Pulse by Nude Sticks. This one has a very gel-like texture to it. It's a little bit different, but it's pretty, and I like the formula a lot. Another one that I like to use is NARS Anna. It's a great color. It has a bit of a mauve type tone to it. I just love this shade. All right, my lips are on fire right now. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to really treat them well tonight. I can't believe I just put on 21 lipsticks. So number 22 is one more Charlotte Tilbury lipstick because I just love these formulas. This is the shade Supermodel. And this is the shade. It's just so pretty and I think is limited edition. So if you like this one, make sure you get it soon. So these are my 22 favorite nude lipsticks. I hope that you found some shades you like in it if you're looking for something as an alternative to the Jaclyn Hill lipsticks. And just remember that we never ever wanna compromise our health for beauty so be very diligent in everything you put on your skin and in your body and if you are a little bit concerned about ingredients or you're starting to think what's going on check out some of my skincare videos as well because I do talk a lot about ingredients and the things you want to be putting on your skin thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I look forward to hanging out with you again soon bye